Hey, hi, how you doing? Bob, Super 25 Sports Cards, coming at you with an LCS recap. Uh, I was over the LCS today. They got a vintage collection in, and I picked up uh, some star cards. I didn't pick up too many commons. I didn't take the whole collection. I just, I'm getting into a look a little bit of a hoarding situation. I got to get organized before I can take in too much. But I did pick up most of the star cards. So I was going to share those with you. <clears throat> uh, started out with, uh, I got started getting into this 69 Deckel Edge set. So I started messing around with it a little bit. So I picked some pieces up. Uh, I got a 69 Denny McLean Deckel Edge, uh, Deckel Edge Rock Carew, Willie McCovey, Carly Ostromsky. Pete Rose, Bob Gibson, I picked up two, two Bob Gibsons actually, uh, I, for the most part I picked up every star card, so like a couple times, like right here I got two of these Clementes, Deckle Edge Clementes, there's some, definitely some doubles and triples and stuff in here, uh, I picked up four of the Deckle Edge Willie Mays, one, two, three, and four. Uh, all the mazes are about the same condition, I would say. Decent. Uh, a couple of them are off centered, but for the most part, they're decent. I uh, picked up two 1980 cars, so technically, I guess they're not vintage, but two of the Hendersons, uh, both in decent condition. I uh, picked up an Ozzy Smith rookie car, but off center, in good condition, other than that, but off centered. Both ways, actually. I uh, picked up one, two, three, uh, 78s. This Schmidt is in real good condition. Uh, this Rose is real sharp. And then I picked up uh, a very nice Eddie Mary, but off center left to right. Uh, picked up for the 77, I picked up two Andre Dawson rookie cards. I have to add those. Two Bruce Suiters. Both in pretty good condition. Uh, all in all, everything's in, in decent condition. I mean, nothing nothing is, uh, I would say, is below, you know, mid-level. But uh, maybe a couple later, but for the most part, pretty good. I picked up two 1976 cards. I picked up a Seaver in very good condition. And a uh, real clean Robin Yount, 76. So that's a nice pickup. Uh, like always, I had to pick up a couple 75s. Seem to always pick up 1975s. I picked up a Johnny Bench. I uh, picked up another Thurman Munson. Uh, a Gibson that's real sharp, but off center, top to bottom. Uh, one of the Mantle Newcomb uh, MVPs from '56. A Hank Aaron. And I picked up some '74s. Uh, '74s. I picked up a Lou Brock. Picked up a Thurman Munson. Picked up a Frank Robinson. Reggie Jackson. Then I picked up two Schmitz. Neither of the Schmitz are in very good condition. They're they're okay. Some centering issues and stuff. Uh, 1973. These are the probably the worst condition cards I picked up were the 73s. Uh, the goose the goose gossage is in decent shape. Not bad at all. Uh, then I got two Aarons, both off centered and both have some soft corners. And then two Clementes, both off centered with some soft corners. No real surface damage or anything like that, but you know, definitely not in very good condition. Uh, then I picked up a bunch of 72s. Uh, I picked up this bench, picked up a Rose. Picked up two Gibsons. Picked up an, a Ryan, off center. And then I picked up four Maze. So all the Mazes are in decent condition, not very, not you know, not great. Uh, a couple are better than others. I guess the, the first, the first one's probably the best one. But four of the seventy-two Maze. Picked up two 71 cards. I have them both, but again, I try never to pass up a good card at a good price. Always use it as trade bait or upgrade or sell it, whatever. 
So picked up a Burt Bly 1171. It's in pretty good shape. And a 71 Thurman Munson's off centered left to right and top to bottom a little bit, but it's kind of an iconic card and a card you really can't get too much of. Uh, picked up three. 1970 cards. I picked up an Aaron that's real soft on the corners, not in very good condition, a little off color too. I picked up a decent Carlton, which I really like that card, so seems like I kind of get a lot of those. And I picked up a, a Maze, so that was nice. Uh, grabbed some 69s. Uh, you know, they weren't in great condition, but they're okay. Uh, I got a 69 McCovey. Pretty happy with that. I got a 69 Killer Brew, uh, 69 Yastrzemski, uh, 69 Clemente, mm, another 69 Clemente, real off center, top to bottom, and a 69 Jackson. It's got some soft corners, it's got good surface, decent centering, but it's got some soft corners. Uh, then I picked up. Uh, 1965 Clemente. A few copies of that, but I love Clemente, so anytime I can pick up a Clemente, I do. Picked up 164 card, it's the Willie Stargell. Like to have that in there. Uh, picked up a 1959, this is a 58 All Star uh, Musual. I have a few copies of this. I just got a couple back from PSA not that long ago, but. I like that card. I like that whole that whole all-star set really. Uh picked up uh a Musual from there too. Brooks Robinson. Two Hoyt Wilhelms. A Warren Spawn. And an Eddie Matthews. They were all nice pickups. Uh, oh, a couple 57s. I picked up a uh, Richie Ashburn. It's in real good condition. So happy with that. Uh, Rocky Calavito. It's in decent shape. 57 tops Calavito rookie. Uh, a Barra, which is in good, con pretty good condition. Decent centering. Got some soft corners, but you know, other than that, it's decent. Uh, a Drysdale rookie. So that was a nice pickup. Just happy to grab that. Uh, have have one that's in pretty good shape, but. Uh, Always nice to add the Drysdale. And then I picked up two 1956 uh, Eddie Matthews and a Whitey Ford. Oh, and uh, the two 1955 Bowman Robin Roberts you see in the background, they're not in good condition at all. That's why I didn't really show them to you, but they were in there too. So I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, I was happy with the pickups. Got the trade day tomorrow, so should be back tomorrow with another video. Uh, for some more pickups. Thanks for watching. Do me a favor, hit that like button, comment if you have any, and sub if you haven't. I'll be back soon. Thanks a lot.